Welcome, this is the energy vibration latent for all Gemini, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. If this is your first time, thank you for being here. Please like and share these videos. Please listen to your April um, um, energy vibration videos and um, like, share, and thumb these videos. Oh, for some people who are asking, <laughs> If they can do donations, yes, you can do donations because what I do, I use it to, um, um, like for the cameras to use it to the cameras because most of the time I'm using my laptop. So yeah, that can. If you have pick up, um, remove the veil of illusions. It's nice if you pick it up, and um, it will help you understand a lot of things that are going on. As I look at your week, it's going to be a wonderful, powerful week. The energy vibration of um, the week is the energy of the moon. It is wonderful. It is a fantastic energy. It is a good energy. It is the energy when the moon comes in, it's awakening your intuition. Not all Gemini's likes that. You're very uncomfortable when the energy of the moon comes in. But this week is the week of a water week. And with the energy vibration of a water week, you should expect these sort of a thing and these sort of a situation coming in. So be aware of this and be very understanding of who you are. As we go forward, we have the energy vibration of um, your focus is going to be the energy vibration of the king of the queen of pentacles the queen of pentacles is always this very strong stability woman who knows exactly what she wants and who will go to any lens to get what she wants in a good way as uh, she will plan her way out and work hard to get there so this is the energy that you need to focus on in this week as we move forward and I'm looking at this week for you guys the energy of the number 10 energy comes in and this is good this is extremely good because this month is actually your this year is actually your year you Gemini's because it is the year of the magician and as I've always said to you Gemini you can always manifest um, the things that you want because you manifest and you pull the things within your energy vibration and you understand where you are so what you do at this time is that you realize here how powerful this is and how creative this is because in the sense of you um, being in this week you're carrying in a good energy vibration because the tens are here twice what is also happening in for your color it's going to be the energy of the um, orange and yellow orange and yellow it's going to um, be so it's going to be creative but yet still it's going to be a prosperous um, sort of an energy of the orange energy is always creative but yellow is always so be very aware call upon your guides and angels to access and help you to understand where you at and how this can help you further in your life this is wonderful as we look at the first day of the week your best days your best days is going to be um, your best days is going to be um, <laughs> this is wonderful because oh, your best day is going to be Thursday somehow there is something that is happening in Thursday because a lot of you air people are having your best days on Thursday so a lot of wonderful things are happening so whatsoever is happening you know it's 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 going to change your life uh, we have the eye princess on um, Monday the energy of the eye princess on Monday it's going to be a really wonderful energy because it's the energy of the moon whenever the moon comes in with eye princess that is selling you that is letting you know how beautiful this week is going to be because your intuition whatsoever you're looking for whatsoever you want is going to be vibrating and going to be rolling in an energy vibration of wonderful new energies one Wonderful new possibilities wonderful new gifts of happiness and joy that is happening so be aware for this and understand your part on Monday because your intuition along with the moon the eye princess and the moon is going to help you on Monday uh, to awaken your intuition so this is good and when it does that you're going to work with the energy vibration 
of this hurt energy the Queen of Pentacles so this is wonderful I'm loving this for you guys so this is going to be extremely powerful this is good um, and Tuesday we have <laughs> The Ace of Wands, new life, new beginning, fresh start for a lot of people. Um, work is coming in for a lot of people. New doors of opportunities are coming in for a lot of people. Be aware of this. This is good because via your intuition, doors of opportunities are going to open up for you and you're going to see a difference. Okay. As we move on, we have in the middle of the week, we have the energy of the knight of pentacles the energy of the knight of pentacles is so foremost in your reading so the energy of the knight of pentacles is really foremost in your reading so expect that some people will be moving some people will be moving with ambition some people will be going um, on wonderful um, places in their life some people will be understanding how important it is for um, you as a person to start moving and elevating at a high energy vibration in your life some people will be understanding and receiving the message uh, via your intuition on what part to move on to so this is wonderful on Thursday you have the four of sword and the four of sword energy is just wonderful the four of sword energy is letting you know that this time this day you need to take rest okay rest take rest take rest take rest take rest okay this day you need to know that you need to take rest because by taking rest you will connect with your angels and guide and they will um, download certain information that you need to have because this information is very 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 important to you at this time on your journey so remember when these energies comes up that is saying to you to take rest you really need to take the time off and yes you're working but you just be quiet on that day you just be quiet and listen listen when we're still and we listen the voices of the angels the voices of our guides the inner voice will help us and guide us okay as we look at Friday we have the ten of cups and the ten of cups is wonderful celebration so whatsoever is happening on Friday there is going to be an extremely wonderful celebration and this celebration is going to help you to elevate something wonderful a nice family gathering is happening on Friday and on Friday you are going to be so connected with everything and everyone and the family is going to be a one of a happy family okay on Saturday you have another ten of um, ten of ones the energy of ten of ones is good because it's the end of a situation so um, the end of a situation so this is good so on Friday you were having a celebration on Saturday you have the ten of ones which is the end of a situation and the end of the situation is going to help you and bring you joy and wonderful things because you have your wishes and dream coming true so this is extremely extremely wonderful you need to understand how much this is uh, happening and how much support this is going to bring in your wishes and dreams are coming true but yet still you are aware that certain things and certain aspect needs to change in your life and with these things happening and these changes happening you're going to be understanding that life is about to change in wonderful ways and your wishes and your dreams will be coming through so remember um with the um, nine of cups and the energy of um, the king the queen of Pentacles is going to be extremely extremely wonderful because what is going to happen is that um, the queen of uh, um, cups and <laughs> and the energy vibration of um, the uh, nine of uh, the queen of Pentacles and the nine of cups <laughs> is going to bring you the energy vibration of wonderful wonderful new surprises and wonderful new things happening in your life which is going to be blessed and wonderful and you're going to be connecting at um, 
a sense of good energies and a good energy vibration that is coming in which is wonderful I'm loving this um, for you guys because as I look at the love section for you guys it's going to be a wonderful powerful strong um, love for some people for some people it's going to be um, I need to have time off for some people in this love arena for some people you want to move away from a relationship that is happening in your life um, it's as if you don't want to be with that person anymore you want to connect with someone else so uh, what I'm getting in is that <coughs> some of you will want to connect with someone of a hurt sign who, who you already knew and um, you're missing that person in some sense and you are wondering if <coughs> being with that person uh, if holding on to that person was not better <coughs> sorry because whatsoever you're dealing with now it's not it's it's not doing it for you happy is not what you're having for some men out there that's what I'm I'm, I'm getting happy is not what you're having and it's as if you're looking back on something that you had with an earth sign person and you're thinking that's the best relationship I've ever had and you're wondering why did I ever change why did I ever because it's so weird because the the astrological um, built in and work down will play certain signs together but I can say and, and and a lot of people have said it too that an air sign with an earth sign can be extremely good can be ex extremely good and when they're together as a relationship and as a partnership in business or in um, love it is a very good relationship so uh, there is someone who is either with um, a cancer which you're not really happy um, you're trying to put the best outside but you're looking back and thinking about this earth sign person so maybe because the energy of um, the element of earth comes up in your reading and this is saying something and it's your focus so most of you whether you're a man or a woman is focusing on an earth sign person that you have a connection with and this connection is um, it's going to be powerful for you because it's going to show you something that you weren't aware of and it's going to be extremely powerful you're missing this person whoever you are out there and all you have to do is call the person and connect with the person work is going to be good um, you need to take a rest it's not going to that doors of opportunities are going to open for you it is that whatever you have now accept it deal with it no because you have the energy of the ten of cup family support and your wishes and dreams are going to come true so whatever is happening whatever is about to happen as I've said if you start listening to my readings all the time you will realize that your life is a start changing because you're changing the way you think about things and by changing the way you think about things it's going to be good your focus is the energy of um, the um, Queen of, 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 of Pentacles and this is good because in this year you um, in this year you 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 people are going to move um, um, and bring a lot of financial um, situation in your life which is going to be extremely extremely good I personally um, is loving this I'm loving this I'm loving this for you Gemini's because you know you Gemini's is one of the signs that I have a very soft spot for because um, when you're good you're just good and some of you are sometimes too good and some of you are sometimes too hard and too outrageous okay but when you are balanced because whenever we have these two of too much of something that mean we're out of balance whenever we are out of balance we'll have this situation and I you know it's wonderful but anyway it's going to be a wonderful week it's going to be your 
um, wishes and dreams are coming true financial situation is going to be good you need to take rest on Thursday whatever you're doing be aware connect with the universal angels okay your last and final card what this is going to be loyal parts isn't this wonderful it's gonna be wonderful isn't it it's gonna be wonderful mm. hey so be aware of what is happening around you because this is going to be a wonderful wonderful experience a wonderful week and uh, with this aspect and the situation you're going to realize uh, um, that life is about uh, life is about to um, open for you in wonderful beautiful um, ways and we are going to experience a wonderful healthy situation in our lives and understand the journey that we're on is about to change in a good 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 